خلال كلمة لجلالة الملكة رانيا العبد الله في المملكة المتحدة ضمن مشاركتها في تجمع لأكثر من ألفي ناشط وقائد شباب في قمة عالم شباب واحد في مدينة بيلفاس بإيرلندا الشمالية في الذكرى الخامسة والعشرين لاتفاق الجمعة العظيمة الذي وقع بين حكومتي بريطانيا وإيرلندا في بيلفاست أكدت جلالتها أن تحقيق السلام مهمة لمدى الحياة وتتطلب تكريس كل ذرة من وقتنا وامكانياتنا He saw his beloved grandfather shot dead at the gates of Al-Aqsa Mosque in Jerusalem. One of the assassin's bullets struck him too, but was deflected by a medal on his chest. I've always wondered if that's why King Hussein lived the rest of his, his years so fully. He saw our time on earth for what it is, finite, fragile, and never to be taken for granted. In 1998, the year of the Good Friday Agreement, His Majesty King Hussein was battling cancer. That fall, he was undergoing chemotherapy. But when he was called to help salvage talks for a milestone agreement between the Israelis and Palestinians, my father-in-law didn't hesitate. He unhooked his IV, left his hospital bed, and flew to Y River, Maryland, to support the parties in their negotiations. وأشارت جلالة الملكة إلى أنه بعد 25 عاما من توقيع اتفاقية واي ريفر يبدو وكأن الصراع الفلسطيني الإسرائيلي أصبح للكثيرين أمرا مجردا استعارة لكراهية مستعصية مكان يفضل العالم نسيانه. In fact, already in 2023, more Palestinians have died at the hands of Israelis than in any of the past 15 years. And every second of every minute of every day, millions of Palestinians are being robbed of their freedom, their rights, their very identity, even as we watch. Palestinian families are being uprooted from their land. Worshippers at Al-Aqsa are attacked and brutalized. Families are buried under homes reduced to rubble, while 12-year-olds are, ja are jailed just for throwing stones, even as we watch. وخاطبت جلالة الملك الحضور بالقول سيكون هناك دائما من يحارب السلام لكن يتوجب على بقيتنا الدفع باتجاهه ولا يتحقق ذلك في يوم أو قمة فتلك مهمة مدى الحياة وقالت علينا أن نعمل بما لدينا لأنه لن يكون هناك وقت مثالي لكن الوقت الراهن في متناول أيدينا الآن To make lasting progress against the problems we face we must devote not only every ounce of our strength, but every ounce of our time. Sometimes we'll feel that time is on our side, and sometimes that it's working against us. But time only moves in one direction, and moments lost can never be regained. Despite strong headwinds, my husband, His Majesty King Abdullah, continues to walk the hard and often lonely path of peace. It is time we populate that path. It is time that Israeli and Palestinian leaders alike do justice by their own people, and that leaders everywhere snap out of complacency and put in the hard work that lasting peace requires in the Middle East and elsewhere. ويذكر أن عالم شباب واحد هي منصة عالمية تشجع القادة الشباب من أنحاء العالم وتستضيف قمة سنوية تعقد في مدينة مختلفة كل عام ويشارك في القمة قيادات شبابية من 190 دولة وأكثر من 250 منظمة